Morning, y'all. <clears throat> um, today's gonna be sort of a vlogish type video. I just woke up and it's like 10:40. <laughs> um, this is my hair right now. I thought it was kind of cool, so I, I, I'm recording this <laughs> right now. But anyways, I'm gonna shower and then. I'm going to walk around my town a little bit. I have some business in the middle of towns. So hopefully I'm going to film some of that and then maybe talk a little bit about what it's like living in <laughs> Inaka, America, <laughs> countryside rural America. Okay, I just got out of the shower. Now I'm gonna shave, brush my teeth, and go outside. Uh, let's see the weather. ま、東バージニアは17度。はい。出かけよう。あいや。しんしゃったドア。あ。だ <laughs> お、パチパチ。いい、いい。おい。はい、アメリカのアメリカの田舎はこんな感じです。出かけよう。よし。今日、あの市役所 に行かないといけないです。あ、学校、小学校だと思う。小、小学校かな。ほら、子供が遊んでいる。かわいい。ああ、綺麗。僕の家です。アメリカの旗。旗。フライング。あれ。ほら見てこの家。綺麗。ちょっと高級 大きくな感じ。すごい。はい、あれはパークスリーウォータータワー。水のため。水のためのタワーです。あ。草この辺なんで and we've arrived in downtown I guess you could call it town center this town is very very small uh, Parksley Virginia it's on the eastern shore of Virginia only about seven or eight hundred people live here I think I 
Okay, I just came back from the town Shakusho uh, office, I guess you could say. And uh, they're having me do redo the town's website because apparently I'm the only young person in this town who cares about this town. So they're having me redo the website because it is not good. Oh, it is bad. And it is really bright. Oh my gosh. Look at the sidewalk, it's just beaming. <sighs> so I'm back home. After walking all the way back. <sighs> Some of you might be wondering, well why did he walk the whole way when there's a car in the driveway? Well that's because I don't have my license yet. <laughs> and I kinda need a license to drive a car. And we're in the house! Back from that mini adventure. I should eat some. I haven't eaten anything. It's like noon already. I should eat. I don't feel that hungry though. It's a beautiful day outside. Uh, so I thought the um, the vlog video that I made yesterday was kind of boring, so I'm going to add to it today. Um, now I'm going to show you guys some really good uh, Japanese YouTubers that you can use uh, to listen to for listening practice in Japanese. This is primarily for upper intermediate to advanced learners of Japanese. There's only really two good ones and that I know of. There's a third one. Well, there's four that I could introduce. But there's really only two good ones that I'm going to introduce to you guys that would be really useful for your Japanese study and your Japanese listening practice. Deはいきましょう. So I have my YouTube homepage open up here and the first Japanese YouTuber I want to introduce is this guy over here, Hikakin TV. He's actually the biggest YouTuber in Japan. Um, he has a great personality. Everyone loves him. As you can see, he has 5 million subscribers. It's really uh, crazy how this guy has taken off. He's been on YouTube for a while. He started doing beatboxing. Really cool guy. Um, he, his Japanese is very わかりやすい, easy to understand, very easily understandable, and I actually translate his videos into English, that's how easy it is for me. Um, occasionally he uses words that I don't know, uh, he doesn't really use too much slang, and he doesn't really muddle his words like most other Japanese YouTubers. He's very clear, um, he makes videos about everything, and I, I'm pretty sure he's putting out a video every single day. And I think that's his goal. For a year, he's putting out a video every single day. And they're on various topics. And he does collabs a lot, as you can see right here with Fisher, who I will talk about as well in this video. Hikakin is a really good channel to follow and to watch if you are studying Japanese and you are an upper intermediate to advanced uh, learner of Japanese. He has other channels too. Hikakin Games. He doesn't. Hikakin, I think, was his first channel his original and then Hikakin blog I'm not sure he uses those as much as he does Hikakin TV that's the main one um, and then if we scroll down here you can see Masuo TV this is my second recommendation Masuo is really good um, because he also uses easy to understand Japanese it's not as hard as other Japanese he's also very very big in Japan. He has, here you can see, one million subscribers, a fifth of Hikakin, <laughs> but Hikakin is, is clearly the, the leader in all of Japan. Masuo's blogs are, mm, they're okay for me. Um, what I prefer with Masuo is his games channel, Masuo Games. This channel, um, I watch him play everything from Zelda to Mario uh, to more hardcore games to Minecraft. This is a really good uh, channel as well if you're practicing your Japanese. 
Uh, a lot of terms related to video games I learned just from muscle games, which is really good. So these are the two main YouTubers I'm using in my personal study for listening practice um, when it comes to natural Japanese, right? Japanese in real life. These two YouTubers provide probably the best uh, practice when it comes to that area of study. There are obviously other Japanese YouTubers. Um, I believe Fishers is the second, yeah, they are the second most popular channel on Japanese YouTube. Now, Fishers is actually a group of Japanese and they do all sorts of things. It's really crazy. Their Japanese, however, is more difficult to catch, more difficult to understand because they're really, they tend to muddle their words when they speak super fast, right? And they use a lot of slang, unlike Hikaki and Masuo. So I don't watch Fishers too much, but when there's something extremely interesting that I see from a thumbnail or a video title, then yeah, like this one, this one looks interesting. So I might save this for later and watch it. Another very popular YouTuber in Japan with nearly 2 million subscribers is Watanabe Mahoto. Um, <laughs> Mahoto-chan. He's, he's, um, hmm. I have to give a warning about Mahoto because he tends to do some very risque things in his videos. Uh, he tends to kind of push the limit of what can be shown on YouTube. And he speaks very fast. He speaks super fast in all his videos. Um, but he does post a lot and he does a various he does various things. It really ranges a lot. And they can be funny or they can be <laughs> outlandish. I recommend watching Watanabe Mahoto if you want to learn kind of more dirty Japanese. <laughs> and let's end it with my channel. Those are all my um, picks for the most useful Japanese channels that you can use to help improve your Japanese, to learn Japanese, to practice your listening. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Otherwise, that's about it. Bye-bye. Peace, guys.